Google Managed SSL certificates are domain validation certificates that Google Cloud obtains and manages for your domains. These certificates support multiple host names and they can be used with global external HTTPS load balancers and SSL proxy load balancers. Google automatically renews Google Managed SSL certificates. After you create a certificate, you may observe that the certificate is stuck in provisioning status. In this video, you will learn how to troubleshoot and resolve common reasons that may have caused a Google Managed SSL certificate to remain in provisioning status. To troubleshoot any issues with Google Managed SSL certificates, you need to first check the status of the certificate. For this, do the following. Go to the load balancing page in Google Cloud Console. In this example, the load balancer named GCP load balancer is configured with a Google Managed SSL certificate. Click load balancing components view. Switch to the certificates tab and select the SSL certificate. The status for this certificate is provisioning. Hmm, there's a warning sign for the domain status. Let's hover over it. It says failed, not visible, which indicates that the certificate provisioning hasn't completed for the domain. To narrow down the reason for failed not visible domain status, do the following. Check if your domain's DNS record resolves to the IP address of the Google Cloud load balancer. In a terminal session, run the command dig followed by the domain name. In our example, it would be dig gcpcloud-domain.com. DNSA and Quad A records for the domain must point to the load balancer's IP address. This output shows that the domain is not resolving to the load balancer's IP address. To resolve this issue, update the A and Quad A records for the domain to point to your load balancer's IP address. See this documentation for more details. Link is added in the description box. Be aware, newly updated DNS A and Quad A records can take a significant amount of time to be fully propagated. Sometimes, propagation across the internet takes up to 72 hours worldwide, although it typically takes a few hours. The domain status continues to be failed, not visible, until propagation is completed. After updating the DNS records, rerun the dig command. Great, the DNS record for the domain is now resolving successfully to the load balancer's IP address. Let's check the status of the SSL certificate. Hmm, the status is still showing provisioning and the domain status is failed, not visible. Next step is to check if the certificate is attached to the load balancer target proxy. Check the value of in use by. In this example, it is none which indicates that the certificate is not attached to the load balancer. To resolve this issue, update the load balancer configuration. To update load balancer configuration, do the following. Click on the name of your load balancer. Edit the configuration of your load balancer. Click on front end configuration. Choose the correct front end. Go to the additional certificates. Click Add Certificate. Select your Google Managed Certificate from the drop-down list. In our example, we will select GCP SSL Certificate. Click on Done, followed by Update. Once we attach the Google Managed Certificate to the load balancer or target proxy, we see that the certificate status now shows as active. Congratulations! We have successfully resolved the issue with Google Managed SSL certificates stuck in provisioning status. For more information on how to troubleshoot Google Managed SSL certificates, check out this documentation. Thanks for watching.